Major developments in the search for missing Chula Vista mother Maya Maliette. For the first time, her husband has been named a person of interest. The revelation came after a city attorney in court uh, mentioned this. The judge also granted News 8 a request to have records unsealed and a gun violence restraining order filed against Maya's husband. News 8's Evan Ronnie joining us live now with these major developments in this case. That's right. There have been a lot of developments in terms of the investigation into Larry Miliete, the husband of missing woman Maya Miliete, missing mother of three Maya Miliete. But little is known still about the whereabouts of Maya Miliete. So this progression that comes yesterday after this court hearing gives us a little bit more information into the reasoning behind a gun violence restraining order. And it also gives some context into uh, the city attorney now admitting that Larry Miliete is is in fact a person of interest. Take a listen to what happened in court yesterday. That original sealing order had a time frame for it. It was not a sealing order that was intended to be in effect forever. And that was the judge uh, confirming to News 8 that the attorney who was hired by News 8 to unseal uh, those documents is right in his saying that uh, the gun violence restraining order should be made public. It was only for a small period of time that that gun violence restraining order was meant to be sealed for and not forever, as you heard that judge say. Now, the biggest discoveries in this hearing, first off, that there is an investigation around Larry Miliete, and he is a person of interest in that. There's also an ongoing child welfare child welfare services investigation into the safety of the three Miliete children. In that hearing, News 8 also hired an attorney which led to the unsealing of the gun violence restraining order that was previously only seen by the court and now must be made public. The only portion of the gun violence restraining order that will remain redacted is the face and body of one of the Miliete children in a photo of him surrounded by Larry's 14 guns. Larry Miliete says his missing wife knew about his gun collection and supported it. He also says that from the start that he is innocent of having any involvement in his wife's disappearance. Now, in terms of when we could actually see those unredacted documents, it is likely that by the end of the week, the judge will actually have those documents available to the public to see and read. That means that by the end of the week, we could gain more context into what allowed that gun violence restraining order to move forward, uh, along with the uh, search warrants of the Miliete family home, the vehicles involved as well. It could just give more context into why the court and why the judge believes that there is an argument to be made against Larry Miliete in the search for his missing wife, Maya. Overlooking downtown, I'm Evan Irani, News 8.